Students can spend their leisure time here in Zagreb in many ways. The city is full of attractions. But some of them, on Sunday afternoon, choose to play board games. Why, we asked. After a small research, we found a place in Bogoviceva 1, where game enthusiasts meet regularly. For many international students, it is a common way of spending time. Yeah, we're studying um, uh, on the Erasmus program. We just by accident found out about it on the Facebook. Like someone asked it, we saw the post and we were like, hmm, why not to go there? Uh, once I was speaking with my friend on the phone and then he invited me there. Recently, playing board games, for example, in Poland or the Netherlands is becoming more and more popular. It's like a board games renaissance. The first ones who got the idea in Zagreb are Matija and Marin, the founders of the Board Games Association. They named it Prostor, meaning space. And they actually found the perfect space and just went for it. Uh, we are the first association, but there are some new associations that came in next years. Opinions are different. Some of them are fascinated, some of them even come here and play with us. Others think it's childish, it's only for children. But as you can see here, everybody is practically an adult. I don't think that there is anybody who is below 18 years old. In the board games club you can find 160 games. Some games are translated into Croatian, while most of them are in English. Games are not just for fun, they can also teach important life lessons and skills. You handle yourself better in stress because here things can get really stressful for you and the things you learn here, you train your brain here so that one day in real life you can handle yourself in a stressful situation and also uh, communication with people. They usually meet every Friday and Sunday in the afternoon. Everyone is welcome to join.